hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel so today i am with the another problem solving video on this uh, milne's predictor corrector method it is the numerical method to solve uh, the first order differential equations were there uh, it is the most important topic as far as video examination video engineering examination is concerned so it is not uh, only uh, applicable for the video students it is uh, almost uh, applicable to all the engineering students who are there in india who are having these concepts over there uh, these uh, numerical maths methods so today i have with the milne's predictor corrector method first of all uh, you have to memorize uh, this particular formula my dear friends no need to go for the derivation if you just remember these two formulas you can easily solve the problems uh, over there so this is y4 predictor is equal to y0 plus 4h upon 3 this h is the step size over there so 2 times f1 minus f2 plus 2 times f3 so this is the y4 predictor formula and another one is the corrector formula that is y4 corrector is equal to y2 plus h upon 3 f2 plus 4 f3 plus f4 predictor over there where this f4 predictor is given by f of x4 uh, comma y4 predictor so if you just memorize these uh, two formulas you can easily solve this particular equation over here so let me solve this particular question solution in which you have to first uh, consider this uh, differential equation as to the conditions initial conditions dy by dx is equal to x square 1 plus y so initial conditions means you have to first write down y of x naught is equal to y naught y of x1 is equal to y1 y of x2 is equal to y2 and y of x3 is equal to y3 so question is already solved dy by dx is equal to x square 1 plus y y of 1 is equal to 1 it is given that is y of x naught is equal to given then y of x1 y of x2 y of x3 these are also already given which i mentioned here y of x naught y of x1 y of x2 y of x3 right so these are given 1 1.233 and y of 1.2 is 1.548 y of 1.3 is equal to 1.979 and evaluate y of 1.4 by milne's predictor corrector method over there so friends uh, these are given values uh, that is y1 is equal to 1 y1 is equal to 1 and y of 1.1 is equal to 1.233 it means that here x naught is equal to 1 and also y naught is equal to 1 as y of x naught is equal to y naught right so this x naught is equal to 1 and y naught is equal to 1 then y of 1.1 is equal to 1.233 which i call x1 is equal to this 1.1 and y1 is equal to this value 1.233 these we have need in the formulas then later on so make it box for it make a box for it so then uh, y is equal to 1.2 is equal to 1.548 it is also given in the question so i can write here x2 is equal to 1.2 and y2 is equal to 1.548 right then one y of 1.3 is equal to 1.979 which is uh, which implies that x3 is equal to 1.3 and y3 is equal to 1.979 Nine. so these are the values which are given and also you can write here step size h step size h is equal to 0 0.1 how this is difference of this uh, particular subscripts that is 1.1 minus 1 that is 0 0.1 1.2 minus 1.1 like that this is the step size over there so h is equal to 0 0.1 in this particular question which you have to use later on in this predictor formula and corrector formula right then you have to uh, find out these f1 f2 and f3 values right so i will start here f naught is equal to f of x naught comma y naught as x naught and y naught are given what are the values one and one so f of one comma one which is equal to, you have to put these one and one in the in, in this particular equation that is x square into one plus y that is one square is one into one plus uh, this y is also 1 so 2 into 1 is 2 so the this you will get 2 over here then f naught is equal to sorry f1 you have to calculate this will become f of x1 comma y1 so what is the value of x1 you have calculated here that is 1.1 comma 1.233 right so just put these x1 and y1 values in this particular equation so let me put these value values in the calc over here so this will become 1.1 whole square into 
this uh, 1 plus y is uh, 1.233 you will get 2.7019 so 2.7019 is the f1 then f2 is equal to f of x2 comma y2 which is equal to f of this x2 is also given uh, sorry you have calculated 1.2 1.2 and comma sorry y2 is equal to 1.548 then put these values in this uh, differential equation that is x value you have to put 1.2 and y value you have to put 1.548 right so this is 1.2 whole square into this uh, 1 plus 1.548 you will get 3.669 3.669 you are getting here that is f2 value then you have to put uh, you have to find out the f3 value right so f of 3 is equal to f of x3 y3 which is equal to f of x3 you have calculated already 1.3 and y3 also 1.977 sorry 974 here right 974 in this case over here so then if you calculate this in the KLC, you will get accordingly 5.0345. Now you have calculated F0, F1, F2, F3. So you can easily now calculate Y4 predictor. Already Y0 is known now. Y0 is equal to 1 and also H is known. F1 already you have calculated here. F2 you have already calculated and F3 you have calculated, right? Now I will just put these values in this particular equation over here. So let me put the values. So y4 predictor which is equal to y0 what is the value of y0 1 right y 1 plus 4 into h h is step size that is 0 0.1 already i have calculated here h is equal to 0 0.1 upon 3 and 2 times f1 what is the value of f1 already calculated f1 is equal to 2.7019 and minus times f2 what is the value of f2 3.6691 and plus 2 times f3 it is the formula plus 2 times f3 so plus 2 into f3 is 5.0345 when you calculate this much y4 predictor which is equal to when you calculate the whole value you will get y4 predictor is equal to 2.5738 in the KLC over there if i just do calculations here in the video it will get too long i don't want to waste your time as examinations are ongoing right now so right so this is y4 predictor is equal to 0.5734 now you can easily calculate this formula f4 predictor is equal to f of x4 comma y4 predictor right so this is f4 predictor which is equal to f of 1.4 as in the question it is mentioned that so y of 1.4 you have to calculate all right so you can give the x value over here is 1.4 so f of 1.4 comma 2.57 2.5738 is the y4 value already you have calculated it so 2.57 this is not actually the y4 value this is y4 predictor already calculated in the above step this is 2.5738 now you can uh, just put these values in the given equation that is dy by dx x square 1 plus y x value you have to put 1.4 and y value you have to put 2.5738 you will approximately get 7.f4 predictor is equal to 7.0046 is the f4 predictor value now you can easily calculate the y4 corrector formula right so y4 corrector is equal to what is the value of y2 already calculated here y2 is equal to 1.548 1 1.548 plus h is already given 0 0.1 upon 3 f2 f2 is already calculated f2 is equal to 3.6691 plus 4 times f3 what is the value of f3 that is 5.0345 right then plus f4 predictor already calculated in this step that is 7.0046 you will get y4 character is equal to you will approximately get 2.5750 so this is the value of y4 character you can also write it as y of x4 or y of 1.4 which is given in the question as already mentioned in the question that y of 1.4 you have to calculate so it is also given as 2.5750 so this is the 
मिलने इस प्रिडिक्टर एंड करेक्टर मेथड आई होप दिस इज अंडरस्टैंडेबल टू ऑल यू पीपल हु आर देयर एज आई हैव क्लियर इट वेरी इन इन द सिंपल मैनर ओवर देयर सो होप फ्रेंड्स यू विल डू इट विद ईज इट इज द सेवन मार्क्स क्वेश्चन एज फार एज द वी टी यू एग्जामिनेशन इज कंसर्न सो डोंट लीव इट दीज आर द वेरी सिंपल कंसेप्ट ओनली थिंग इज यू हैव टू मेमोराइज द फॉर्मूलाज एंड जस्ट राइट डाउन अकॉर्डिंग द न्यूमेरिकल वैल्यूज इन द पर्टिकुलर प्रॉब्लम and you should tackle it with ease over there if they, there may be some different equations like uh, there may be x cube 1 plus y of higher order also but it is you are solving here uh, in the form of first order differential equations so thanks for watching my video my dear friends